you know, it was something where I, I said to myself, I can paint any figure that I want in Sarasota. I could do beach scenes, I could do the orchestra, I could do the opera, I could go to the airport and just sketch people, but it was the ballet that, that resonated with me and, and I think through the figures and, and, and their actions and what it is that they're doing, uh, it spoke loudly to me and I, it, it was a match. It worked well with what it was that, and what it is that I want to do with, with the paintings themselves. After the recession was over, uh, I really started rethinking my figurative works and wanted them to convey more. And after spending more time walking around in museums and looking at some of the major works there, uh, it became a realization to me that my figures needed to be doing something, serving some sort of a record. At the same time, I, I've also noticed and have noticed uh, the importance of the performing arts in our community. And the ballet was one that always intrigued me because I never really attended the ballet, although um, the figures were there. And so I wanted to create something completely and entirely original for Sarasota of the ballet. I was fortunate enough to be able to, to start going to the rehearsals and bring sketchbook with me and eventually a camera so that I could uh, gain reference uh, to create these compositions. Look at, look at them, you know, you have this one, looking at this one, who's like focusing on over here. And she's thinking about the next move that she's going to make. Meanwhile, you have these folks in the background who, you know, the solitude of, of him by himself or this girl who's, you know, getting ready. Who knows what they're talking about? She's focused, you know, thinking about, you know, when she might go on. And so there's this whole kind of demystification of like this perfect ballerina because the strap broke and she's trying to help her before they, they gotta go and perform. So I think that that, it, it's much like going into the artist's studio like, like we are now and, and seeing this before it's done. Part of what helps an artist such as myself or an artist like me thrive in a community like Sarasota or in Sarasota is through the support of not only my close and immediate family but also through the support and understanding and collaboration of, of this community. And it's with that kind of collaboration and understanding that we thrive. For more information and an in-depth look at these stories and more, go online to yourobserver.com daily, like us on Facebook, and follow The Observer on Twitter. And pick up a copy of The Longboat in East County Observer Wednesday and The Sarasota Observer and Pelican Press Thursday. For more videos and fresh local content, go to the Observer YouTube page and press subscribe. You, your neighbors, your neighborhood.